a Jimmy Brennan production. How's everyone doing tonight? Oh man, how about them Las Vegas drivers, right? Am I right? I mean, where did they learn how to drive? Hell? <laughs> now I'll tell you what, speaking of hell, might be uh, might be colder in hell than it is in uh, Las Vegas in July, am I right? <laughs> oh, I know I am. Goodness, speaking of drivers, you know these drivers out here? I mean, I think that uh, they're either uh, dying to get somewhere or they're just trying to get somewhere to die and play Kano. <laughs> All right. Anyway, speaking of dying, you ever like really dislike somebody like so much that like you secretly to yourself are like saying bad things about them? Like, like I don't know, like they could be in the audience right now, you know? I'm not saying they are, but they could be. And, and uh, you were just like thinking that like, I hope they get the clap, you know? I'm not. And I'm not talking about the good clap, you know? Not like like the Hollywood slow clap when the protagonist makes like a dramatic realization. You know, or something like that. No, I'm talking about the bad clap. I'm talking about the clap goes down there. All right? That's what I'm talking about. Anyway, thank you for your time. I'm good. All right, everyone. Thanks for coming out tonight. Yeah, give yourself a round of applause. It's amazing. Yes. Um, yeah, tip your bartenders. Awesome. Yeah. I also want to let you know I'll be inboxing the winner of Best Set tonight, who will be coming with me to where? Uh huh. New York City. Yes, to open for me at the Apollo, if you dare. All right. Well, thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Have a good night. Well, I mean, it's gonna like take them a couple of days. I mean, they can't just like uh, come right out with me as the winner and all because then it would like not seem fair to everyone else. So they gotta like make it seem like it's a competition, make it seem like, you know, so I'm sure, I'm sure it'll come out real quick, real soon. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> No messages. <laughs> Clearly Bob the Booker. Don't know talent when he sees it. It's go time. Problem, man. If you weren't had your in your phone all day, you know you've had in your phone all day, then you would know and you would hear the funny jokes, and then you would see the funny jokes and know the funny comedians, and you'd book them. All right, that's what that's what's happening. That's your whole problem. That's your that's your problem is. Hmm. Well, now you know, Dan Dansby. Honey, can I offer you and your friends some cookies? Mom. We're having a very important conversation about my future. Thank you very much. All right now, where were we? Where was I? Anyway, mom does make some killer cookies though. You know, you want some? Yeah, sure. Cookies sound great. Okay, mom, we'll take them cookies. You want milk with that? You want some milk with that? No, I'm fine. You see, Bob, that's what your problem is, man. What kind of psycho doesn't have milk with his cookies? I'm lactose intolerant, man. Sorry, don't kill me. 
kill you? <laughs> I don't want to kill you. What would I do without you? Go back to ripping off mob bosses? <laughs> you seen the Dark Knight before? Come on, man, lighten up. You act like you've never been kidnapped before. <laughs> sure, a guy like you get kidnapped all the time. No. First time for me. Oh, goodness. I'm your first kidnapping. <laughs> I feel so special. Mom, you forgot my milk. Don't worry, I'll get it. Dad, <laughs> I hope your friends like chocolate chips. Um, excuse me, Mrs. Uh, uh, Mom of the guy that kidnapped me. Um, like, listen, uh, I'm not sure if you're aware of what your son's got himself into, but uh, no worries. Uh, just untie me and, uh, you know, like, we can forget this whole thing and put a ride past his water under the bridge, man. So just let me go, and uh, I'll, I won't tell so. We'll forget the whole thing ever happened, okay? Now listen, son. I'm not just his mama, and I'm not just his manager. I'm his mama, Jeff. And if it's the last thing I do, he's going to be successful. This whole thing here was my idea. Now like 50 Cent says, get rich or die trying. A Jimmy Brennan production.